Hey, hey, y'all. I'm coming back to you guys with another quick session over here. Um, just wanted to show you guys cards that I just pulled. We have the Nine of Cups and the Queen of Spheres. So, um, Queen of Pentacles type of energy. Somebody that is about their money right now, about their abundance, about getting a bread, making a bread. Oh, I'm just kicking the camera and everything. I'm thinking my little space over here is... A little crowded um <laughs> another space that i read from so uh yeah so queen of, queen of spheres about her money uh player type of energy or nine of cups just really feeling really loving and luscious so not only are you about your money but your cups you got like nine cups over here so you single single yes i'm feeling single queen of spheres out here getting your money getting your bread maybe you got a lot of burdens up spirit says this way lovers lovers is in with the seven of cups maybe you're gonna have options hold on now let's get this card down here we got seven of cups to you with the lovers miss single queen of spheres over here out here getting your bread you know you nine of cups you loving you single you know you doing your thing with the seven of cups is options with the lovers is like new booze coming in like you're gonna be looking to the left looking to the right looking front behind you like they're gonna be popping out of everywhere boo you got options but make sure you use your discernment because seven of cups everything ain't good to you or good for you so make sure you pay attention give yourself some space be able to uh see you know what is the spirit telling you about this person feel they spirit out you know check they light out how they operate and how they moving what they focus on before you uh jump into anything because again coming in options coming in but you don't want to be taking on anybody's burdens right ten of wands is also here people come with a bag you know and it could be that somebody is uh wanting to be successful with you somebody from your past one of these options could be because i had three splits in my deck we have six of wands here which is somebody hoping to be successful. Hopefully, it's going to be successful. But we have seven of wands here, which is blockage, you know, protection. And this right here, the six of cups, is past love. So, maybe that you will be successful blocking out past, past shit, right? past love whatever was in these cups if it's in the past might not have been good for you or good to you you know because it definitely didn't last but with that six of wands something or somebody that energy feels like they want to have success with you but that seven of wands uh uh six of swords sorry somebody wants to move towards you i felt like it was wands but it's not it's swords it was six of swords i can clearly see the card so somebody wants to move towards you or uh yeah move towards you but um that seven of wands you're protected from whatever that six of cup energy is stay in your queen of swords energy blocking shit out if it ain't good to you don't take it right because somebody wants to try and hold on to your energy but they are in a five of sword energy right whoever they are they working on something that's in this five of sword energy Right, five of sword energy is uh you know, it's like sneaky, deceptive, crafty, manipulative, you know, trying to sneak away with something. You know, you see in the other tarot this person got like it's two swords on the ground, they holding three, it's sloppy, you know what I mean? They sneaky. So yeah just be careful stay in your energy keep doing you keep your hands to the plow keep your eyes forward yeah everything will be good but you're gonna have options honey you got options one of them is somebody from your past you're gonna have to cut that shit out block it out i think you already blocked it that seven of wands said block right um we had uh you're protected from that might even not even yeah protected from that the higher thing if that energy is like done you protect it um spirit says hell no 
that's not coming in. But opportunities for relationships and something stable is here. And you will have options. You are abundant in your Queen of Pentacles energy. Right, Queen of Pentacles energy. You're single with the Nine of Cups, still loving. People are gonna notice that you want to love on you, but everybody that comes to you ain't gonna be good for you. So make sure you use your discernment, right? Make sure you use your discernment, and so you don't want to be bringing in other people's burdens and taking on any bullshit, you know, and 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 messing up what you got going on in your life and your forward progression. Yeah, Eight of Cups, that shit. Walk away from it right no sir no thank you because again people be wanting to bring bullshit into your life they've been magicians future faking right maybe that your past person that you was with was a you know emperor uh mature male set up established seeming to be like that solid four cup energy but with that magician energy um yeah maybe they just weren't really you know who they said that they were Again, you had a relationship with that past person. They are hung up and delayed in something and whatever they're feeling. You know, this two of wands, they plotting and trying to make a choice. They want to come back to you collective because they see you as that, you know, was stable, that four of wands here. And the tower was in reverse. So maybe they've already had some enlightenment, some change that's done happen. Or definitely you guys broke up. This shit is the breakup. Yes. Spirit said, this is the breakup from the past. The tower has already come, come down. So don't you choose to go back to this mess. They trying to figure out how to come back to you. But you stand your ground. The Ace of Wands is in reverse. Don't do it. And the spirit, the sword of truth, the Ace of Swords is in the upright. Spirit says, that's true. Walk away from whatever the hell this Six of Cups was. No. Absolutely, fuck not. You're gonna have brand new options over here. You will be able to choose, use your discernment, see what's good for you, good to you. Take your time and choose. There's no need to rush, right? It's all good. Enjoy the day. Go out and play. Get dressed and go slay. Y'all, hey, uh, this reading is done. Ashe. Until the next time, Ashe. Love you guys. Like, subscribe, share the videos. See you soon.